Every person is a hero on his own epic journey. Growing older, being unwell or marginalized does not take that away. But the yearning and potential for health, friendship or growth may need support. As we see with Madame Loke, a frail, at-risk elder living alone. Epic as a program is named for the heroes we support. Ours is a developmental approach. Clear, medical and psychosocial targets are set for each participant. For these frail elders to age at home, as they wish, we provide a comprehensive range of services. These are driven by an interdisciplinary team using a care management approach. We train them, we ask them to exercise, so at least I want them to, to walk back. Yes, I'm very happy because important things, if the smile is, is, is from the bottom of their heart, that is my happiness. The elders' attendance at a day club allows us to track how well each person is doing. We provide tight medical monitoring and we meet daily to review their care plan. To contain cost and optimize resource use, we aim for everyone to get the right care in the right amount at the right time. This program is designed to um, support older people who wish to live in the community, staying at their own home even when they are at high risk for institutionalization, that means admission to a nursing home. Typically, they have got many medical conditions that cause them to be disabled, and also many of them are financially strained and may not have uh, committed caregivers to support them at home. All in all, it's really a place where they come, but at the same time, there is medical monitoring, there is case management, there is a comprehensive geriatric assessment to identify needs and coordinate services to support them in their own home. Physiotherapy is customized to individual needs. It also includes community ambulation when needed. The elders feel valued and find a family through our person-centered care. When my wife passed away, I stay alone. I have to take care of myself. But I come down here, it's really like you know, second family. They take care of me when I need to see the doctor, they bring me and bring me back. So when I come here, at least there's so many people and they, they care about me. So it's like my second home. Helping the elders to overcome their isolation is critical to their well-being. EPIC also relieves the stress on caregivers. They APIC is modeled after the program of all-inclusive care in America. To get here, we too have been on an EPIC journey. Our ability to offer its team-managed interdisciplinary care came by way of pioneering other elder care services to support aging in place. That happened over 20 years at the Wame Center for Successful Aging. EPIC is 20 years in the making for us. Uh, when Foundation first started in 93 and we first came here, uh, we very much already had that blueprint in mind. 
in that process of building up all our other clinical programs like the medical home care, care management services, our primary health care, the counselling services, our TCM clinic. Even as of today, EPIC is of course a part of that six uh, clinical programs under HMCSA. She cannot stay in the hospital because it was too expensive and she is not used to that kind of way in the hospital sickness people around her. Giving me a lot of headaches, harassing me day and night, wanted to get out. Thank you very much for all your good work. EPIC's impact is being studied in a randomised controlled trial that will provide robust evidence for its viability as a program solution in long-term elder care. And we do need innovative approaches backed by research to meet the challenges of a rapidly graying Singapore. EPIC shows that with the right support, even with frailty, our heroes find their way to better health, wider smiles, while aging in the community. Wame Center for Successful Aging, first stop, one stop service provider for holistic health and psychosocial care over the life stages to enable aging in the community.